this. It's an incredibly involved process of turning on a cheat code to freeze, freeze the time of day, and also to give me infinite stamina. As you can see, time's not going up. And my stamina's not going down. So we will proceed to clear this entire, entire, entire farm. Easy. Not a single bit of difficulty. I probably would have done this anyway. It just, you know, would have taken longer. It would have taken longer to do. And to be honest, as much fun as it is, I don't really have a problem with it. Now, I believe there is a special way to... go a little bit faster. Making the clicks go a little bit. Say that was a good one. Some degree of 
Life's tough. Life is tough. And when things are tough, you need a reason to face that toughness.
see some loose. I think they stay on the screen. I don't know how quickly they uh, decompose out of the uh, stuff. I don't know how quickly, if I were to just leave these around and not pick them up, they would stay there. I have a feeling they would eventually disappear. I think my next task, right directly after this, is going to be rebuilding the uh, bridge on the beach for, if I'm not mistaken, I feel like it was actually like 500 wood, like significantly more than what it used to be. I think it used to be like 300. Now again, I could be totally wrong. I'm not an expert at this game. This is my first time playing. But I believe it used to be 300 and it is now 500. Obviously, I could check that. Obviously, I could check that. For right now, I'm happy with just making, you know, crazy unfounded claims. That's fun. Now my other question is, what is that sound? That like kind of ghostly wailing? I feel like it's, it has something to do with the fact that it's raining. You. There it is. That's what I wanted. I feel like it has something to do with the fact that it's a rainy day. I like that you can kind of swing the axe around elsewhere. That's nice. Now my other question... If I clear out all of the trees, will they never grow back? Will I have to, like, do something to them? Or will they just naturally spring up out of nowhere, even if there are no trees around? Even if there are absolutely no trees around, and therefore, you know, no way to get seeds. What do you think? Are they going to grow back? I tend to think yes. Which definitely lines up with reality more. Because just because there's not any trees in your, you know, immediate vicinity doesn't mean there aren't any in other places. Ah, um, interesting. was thinking I wouldn't be able to cut down the bushes with a, an axe. I kind of thought I needed a uh, scythe. Guess not. I guess it's just more efficient to use the scythe. That's fine. I'd rather be more efficient anyway. Everything else should be way faster. Everything. 
everything else should be incredibly wildly fast comparatively. Ah, not what I wanted to do. That's fine, it's not a big deal. So our first max stack of wood has been achieved. Not always. 
use, but oh, it's this uh, radioactive goggles. Let's put you on. Oh yeah, baby. The goggles do nothing. No problem. They make you look cool. That's all you need. That's the only thing goggles are good for. Eye protection is a myth sold to you by crazy people who want to sell goggles. All eye protection, ear protection, it's a total scam. Definitely doesn't do anything. You can trust me, I'm a disembodied voice whispering on the internet. I'm absolutely a reliable source for these types of things. I don't love how these glasses essentially eat my entire face, but I think I'm going to need the hot bar room. I feel like I might. I feel like we might max out a bar of sap. Come on, there you go. No, come on, there it is. That's it, we got you now. You got it, swing that axe. Okay. I was gonna say, I wanna check. check to see if I can mine these big stones. I don't know. My guess is I can't. My guess is there are going to be gates as well. We already know that these big ones I can't cut down. These big logs, I can't cut them down. I can't cut down the big hardwood stumps either. So, that's a gate. But otherwise, pretty much everything else. My guess is I'll be able to clear those big boulders. It's just gonna take more time. You know? That's my guess. That is my guess. I wanna get that one tree before we start on this row. I'm gonna walk back around and I think I can get it. Like I said, I'm trying to go tool by tool. I'm trying to go tool by tool. Both because it saves on space, inventory wise. And also, it's slightly more uh, aesthetically appealing to move like that. Okie dokie, that's about as far as we can go there. Should we clean that up? Yeah, I want to clean that up. I want to clean up this side over here. Probably not the most efficient way to go, but... That's okay. I cannot get to that. Um, and it doesn't look like... Can't get to any of those either. That's fine. Like I said... Well, okay, I don't think I actually said it, but I meant to say it. We're not gonna get everything all at once. We're gonna have to do a couple sweeps, likely. I think after this, I will pull out the scythe. I think that's my best bet. Getting rid of all of these bushes. Obviously the first thing we're gonna have to do is store all of this stuff. That's gonna be our, you know, that's gonna be our main priority to be perfectly honest. 
because I don't even know if we're going to be able to... I was going to say, I don't know if we're even going to be able to get all of this stuff, collect everything, without getting in there. I don't know, we might. I've, I have a sneaking suspicion we'll be okay. But we are rapidly approaching two stacks. Rapidly approaching two stacks of wood. Two full stacks of wood. And I can't get, well, we're gonna have to sacrifice a little bit of my aesthetic integrity and a little bit more. We had to get it. We had to do it. It had to be done. It had to be done. Now the other reason I would like to go side first is I think Mining all of these rocks is the likeliest to give us a whole bunch of other resources like, you know, coal and, uh, I don't know, geodes, other stuff like that, which very likely is going to pull up our uh, bar. Very likely that's going to fill up our because we only have, what, 12 slots? Not a lot. Not many. Not bad, though. Okay. Blip. And then plonk. I don't think I can get to these. Maybe I can. Let's try it. Let's try to get at them from up here. I have a feeling I'm not going to be able to. Well, at least some of them I can for sure, right? Nope. How about you? I can get to you. Yeah. Let's do it. From there, I should... I should be able to get you. Good. Excellent. I'm not going to be able to get that one branch. That one little dead log right here. That one I am going to have to open up. And... Yup, same with this. And you. I don't think I could have gotten to you either. No. So those four or five trees are, as far as I can tell, final trees. They are the final, final, final. What is this? The final trees. I also want to dig those up if I can. Yeah, just get all the pine cones, get all the uh, stuff that I can. So look at that. Gotcha. Boink, boink, boink. And actually with this out of the way, I think I can see a path. Nope. That was the most efficient way to do it. And yeah, we should be able to get to the final two trees. got like a 
straight up maze scenario. Okay, good enough. I think that's everything. Let's take a look. Looks pretty good to me. I am gonna keep my axe. I am gonna keep my axe. Because I think I'm gonna need it, but we are gonna switch over. We're gonna switch over to the side. And this is good, this we're gonna be able to do a lot of quick clearing here. We're gonna be able to do rows. It's gonna be pretty nice. That's intentional, though. Oh, okay, that was my question. I was wondering if those little bushes would survive. Or I should say little saplings. I do wonder if they're called saplings when they're just budding. That's how I mow my lawn. 
you know, a lot of overlap, you know, a lot of overlap, like more than I need. I could easily have started another row significantly further over. I didn't want to. Okay. We're gonna have to get that on a second pass, unfortunately. And you. 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 Okay. And you. 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 There we go. associate the word tuft with hair, not grass. I wonder if you could, you've got to be able to get those. Come on, there you go. You have to be able to catch those frogs somehow. So these 
these are all one hits. But we can't clear them quite as efficiently. Not quite. Still. Not too bad. It's not too bad at all. How about this? Okay. So anything will dig up those trees. That's good. Oh yeah. Okay, that's our first geode. Delightful. Our first. First geode. Delightful. I hope you like this pattern I'm going in. You know, you can do strips. Or you can do this. Pickaxe is not strong enough. That is about actually what I assumed. The other option is you do the circle. You circle around in ever narrowing cycles. Yeah, it's definitely not going to be our best bet for this, but that's okay. Just getting this outer ring. And we'll hit that. I like it. I think it works. It's gonna work okay. Not the most efficient, but it's okay. Is wasted here. No rocks wasted. Getcha, getcha, getcha. Oh, oh, oh. Get it. There it is. Boink, boink, boink. Le no. Boink. 
this is the... That's the load. That's where the stuff is. Yeah, now we don't need to go down the... We don't need to go down around the edge. Let's get these. Let's get them. Resources squandered. And uh, you, 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 and then you, and then you, and then. All right, stop the clock. We have done it in a little bit less than an hour. The sun has yet to even rise. That easy, huh? Yup, exactly that easy. All you have to do is, as I said, ch -ch 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 cheat. I am gonna keep you, I'm gonna get the rest of my equipment out. And also my fish, I think I'm gonna sell this clam. sell it. I'm gonna sell that clam. Okie dokie. I cannot, unfortunately, clear any of the rest of this. That is a bit of a shame, but no big deal. Thank you for tuning in. I hope this was enjoyable. Good luck in all of your endeavors. I shall say